corazoncitos, corazoncitas, bebecitos, bebecitas. Bienvenidos a nuestro canal. Welcome to our channel, my loves, my babies. I have a hot mess in my house. And I didn't care to clean it up. I just got back from Paris yesterday, so I'm gonna film a video about that later. But today's video is good because I am sharing with you another manifest video. These perfumes are perfumes that I feel will get me steamy romantic nights in 2023. Manifest all day. I'm gonna manifest this just as much as I want a million dollars. I'm gonna be a millionaire with steamy romantic nights in 2023. You think I'm playing? I add steamy, I emphasize steamy romance because it's not just soft romantic, but it's also not raunchy romantic. That's, that's coming up next. <laughs> I'm sorry for my light. I want you to look at my face, not my chest. Or do I? Okay, let me get closer. Oh, this is bad. Okay, this might be better. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <sighs> Jesus. Okay, maybe this is better. This is passed out right here. Okay, mamacitas, papacitos. We're talking about steamy romantic nights. Rewind. I don't know what I said before. <laughs> I was trying to fix my light. We're talking about like steamy romance. Like that kind of, those kinds of date nights where like there's so much tension but nothing happens, right? There's like this energy flowing between the both of you and you're just like when you get close to each other you get this this fire in your gut and it's like exuding through your lips and you just want to make out maybe this is the paris in me talking but i am manifesting that this year for me and for you because everyone can live without a million dollars nobody can live without this experience of having steamy romance, steamy romantic date nights. Mm. So these perfumes, I feel, are gonna get that for me. Let me know which ones are going to make your date nights steamy and romantic and just <sighs> epic. Delicious. The first one we will talk about is one of I feel the most steamy romantic sense that I'm doing this a lot today. Am I? Is it just me? Am I just? I'm a different girl. I'm a Parisian. I'm a different girl now after Paris. I'm gonna learn French. Anyway, for a long time this has been such a romantic, steamy, beautiful scent that really puts me in that mood. <laughs> Tom Ford Noir de Noir. I used to wear it a lot. <sighs> I think it was last year or two years ago. I just find this so like dreamy and romantic and steamy. I'm gonna say those words a lot in this video. But the chocolate rose, so gorgeous, is so beautiful in this scent. It's equally as like, romantic feminine as it is masculine i i feel like it brings out that power in both sexes this is one of tom ford's best creations in my opinion i don't think i like i smell anything else like it it's a gourmand that is not you want to gnaw on your fingertips it's a gourmand that's giving this romantic vibe that you just are like locked in with that person's eyes and you're just like fiending for their touch you know that is tom ford noir de noir why does it have that name but it's perfect okay so for a more softer approach to that steamy romance i feel Lur narcotic by ex nihilo Ni, ex ni, I'm not. Okay, I haven't learned French yet. This is such a romantic but come hither scent. As well, 
like equally as romantic masculine and feminine it is like this is like the steam steaming off your body when you are experiencing those emotions with someone else this is like what I picture like hormones steaming off my body and like trailing their way to the other person, right? Like the romance, the steam, like the, the aura to you. The beautifulness that is and the romance that is in this bottle is beautiful and it lasts and you can smell yourself you can smell this cloud of like yeah that steamy floral musky hormonal hormonal in a in a sexy not erotic but sexy you know like sexy steamy way what was i saying <laughs> soft kind of like subtle but very present but like you feel that energy that's this one now this one it to me is the same feel same vibe but more flirtatious right so kaoli vanilla 28 i know everyone has it as like their come hither perfumes which is true, but it's like, it's, it's so romantic and like a really fun, flirty, like, I picture this steamy romance to be like laughing and touching each other, like f just very flirtatious, very like playing with your hair, um, like playing footsie under moving I'm moving she's moving she's imagining she's wants a steamy romance every night <laughs> so this to me is steamy romantic but very flirtatious very innocent very juvenile and by juvenile I don't mean young juvenile I mean like free and fun and just lip biting and delicious Kayali okay, 28 vanilla 28 now more on the romantic side this to me is the epitome of romance like floor narcotic that like steam that's coming off your body i feel like this is the same but more in like a romance way this is like love parisian musk i can't with this scent the musk the freshness and the fig in this perfume make me want to lay down and like not breathe. It's stunning. It's beautiful, romantic, steamy, in love. Like, wow. Every time I smell this perfume, Parisian Mask by Mattia Premier. I'm trying it just brings me to my knees it's the beauty in this indescribable it's just you just have to smell it it's one of those you really really have to experience it's euphoric I can't explain it if you've tried it let me know let me know what you think because it is this is a beauty and it puts you in that romance like such dreamy vibes such a dreamy mood such a dreamy experience i got one more i'm going so fast i'm going so fast i'm so proud of myself last one and i'm not sure if you guys have really heard or tried this one because i hadn't really and i blind bought it and i think it has been my best blind buy to date. I really think so. And it, it took me for a loop. I was kind of really scared to blind buy this, but I did it 
and obviously I do not regret this is stunning so you guys know my love for Rosendo Mateo number five this is number six oh Oh, it has the the DNA of Rosendo Mateo. So like you you smell it and it does smell similar to number five, but it's completely different. Obviously, it's totally different. This is a jasmine sandalwood oriental musk. The creaminess, the musk the sandalwood and the jasmine that is in the scent oh my god monzio no monzio ay dios mio it's why do i always do that open close open close open. she's beautiful she's has a little bit of that sharpness because of the dna i feel like this house has it's like tiny tiny bit of like pungent but so creamy and different and jasmine and it's like you smell all these notes it's exactly what it describes jasmine sandalwood oriental musk it's just beautiful this has been my best blind buy and it's so steamy romantic you guys know number five is the sexiest Sex bomb, bomb. <laughs> But this is like steamy romance in a bottle. This is that euphoric feeling of being with another person and you're just in sync and you know it's gonna lead to somewhere maybe in the next few dates, but you just want to experience this energy with that someone for the, as long as you can. This is gorgeous. I feel like if you like this house and you like number five and you love jasmine and sandalwood, like the, you, I feel like you would absolutely adore number six. That's it! Number five! What? That's it! Five! Five steamy romantic perfumes that are gonna get us steamy romantic date nights in 2023. Let me know what yours are so we can manifest together. Los amo, corazones. Los amo. Please comment. You know the drill. Comment below. Let me know. And let me know if you've had them already in 2023. I mean, we're already like almost in February and this is perfect content for Valentine's Day. Los amo.